Alright, welcome guys to another episode. This one's a bit different. Because, uh... Well, firstly, this isn't my build. Well, I mean, it's half my build. And more like a third, don't worry about it. This is a guy by the name of Exeros's, um outline, I guess. Essentially, this airship was made in preparation for the release of Create Aeronautics, and I'd just like to show it off before I have to completely redesign this thing with Exeros when it inevitably crashes to the ground in two seconds when we use the airship assembler on it. Uh, I'll get the full little 360. Push forward things, emergency helicopter, Flaps to move it, hot air balloon to levitate it, float it, bop it, twist it, pull it, you know, the good stuff. Alright, so firstly, retractable landing gear, as you do. And this is a whole server, by the way. Like, completely public. Well, mostly public, I don't know. Okay, well, that'll... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, oh, 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 god, oh. Oh, my gosh. Why are you on? Who sent you to toggle? Some, some chucklehead placed it twice! Uh, Freaking... I don't know, this is like a big collaboration. I don't even know if they turned it on right. Regardless, we're breaking this one and we're breaking... Heh! Should be people in their showcases. Alright, now it works. This is just a lift. I don't know, I think extra is maybe wish. Oh, the location of... So we deploy the ladder to get down, or we can undeploy it. Uh, let's uh, let's retract the landing gear. Here's the engine room. Now, uh, keep in mind, all of this was designed by me. All of this. So, like, every time you say, oh, x did all the work, nah, all of this was also designed by me. Be impressed. Yeah, I know, I'm cool. Thank you. This is a level 9 boiler in this little space. I do not know why we need three gear shifts to power this thing. Oh, three engines. 48,000 stress units for that? We only need one for this one. Uh, 32,000, We've only used a little over half of the stress units we could use. Or we might need, so... So this is the lower floor. Oh, we also got a balcony. We 
can look out over the peasants beneath us. Not fall in this crack. Yeah, definitely not. <laughs> Anyways. We got the plunge lever. It plunges. The gear button? I don't know what the gear button- Oh, okay, that's- We have a lot of toggles for the landing gear. I don't think we need this one, though. Do we really need this up here? Not really, right? You can just go down here and press this button. Or this one. It's literally in range. And this is where we're gonna control the main area. Co-pilot. Pilot. Co-pilot 2. I don't know why we have these things here. I guess they're just gauges. They look fancy. Same with this 15. Not sure why that's there. Oh, it's telling me the redstone strength of the lever outputting. I don't know why that's there either. The boiler status. In case we randomly fall out the sky, we can know why. Won't help us, but, you know, well, it might, depending on how high we are. Botanical area. I feel like we should at least half make this useful. I don't know, I'm, I'm gonna plant some potatoes. Potato. Potato? Potato? No potato? Potato? Potato. Alright, so here we have a table. There's gonna be a lots of tables with seats, I don't know why. More balconies. Maybe we should use uh, the create big cannons. To make something, I don't know. This hallway. Coffee's room. The arrow room. For real. It needs. For real, it needs more. Plunger. Oh, there's a plunger. Don't know what that's. There's no door there. This is Gray's room. Don't know who Gray is. This is my room. Waddles is not my pet. I don't know how he got here. I don't want to kill him, though, so... Rio the Pog. Very basic room. This one's, like, abandoned. staircase, because I wouldn't know what that is otherwise without the sign. Thank you. And we're back here. So now if we go... Now we can go up here. And there's this little pathway to the helicopter, helicopter. Which for some reason this is three wide. Uh, and doesn't fit on the ship properly, but whatever. This one also works. Let's see if we take control of this one. We can control the tailspin with A and D. Shift to turn on the top helicopter, and then there's a propeller back there that'll let us go forward. We'll replace the creative motor with a Sterling engine later. And then here's um, a decent little storage room. 
and then the uh, open air balcony. Ah. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, of course. This balloon actually will work with some, like, blaze, discount blaze burner if we power it with redstone. It'll turn on. Wouldn't recommend going out here since there's no guardrails. I don't know why they stop right here. Oh, wait, no. If you have an elytra on, I'm sure you could just abandon ship in emergency. Yeah, this world's filled with cool things. Uh, official create aeronautics testers land the server. So this, if you watched one year of create aeronautics, this is actually the flying island from that video. It was, that was a serial. That was this amazing, beautiful airship. I'm gonna turn it into a schematic really quickly. Oh yeah, obviously it's all gotta be glued together, otherwise it's gonna fall apart. Beautiful. 